What is up guys and welcome to today's video. We have got something pretty special indeed. We're going to be combining Call of Duty and FIFA. It's going to be pretty sick. I cannot wait. So you guys are probably thinking how are you going to do this Jack? Uh, basically I'm going to be opening packs on both Black Ops 3 and also FIFA Ultimate Team and seeing where my money is going and how much I can get from say £30 on FIFA. £30 on Call of Duty. So, it's going to be interesting. I feel like I might appreciate Call of Duty a little bit more um, in the sense that I could be getting these legendary items and these rare items, etc. Whereas on FIFA, I kind of have to get like an inform to get to that kind of stature and I'm not too sure if I will be able to in £30 worth of FIFA points. So, it's going to be interesting. Um, let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see me do any more FIFA versus, versus COD in some other way, shape or form, like in the 7 Minute Squad series. That would be pretty sick if you guys could let me know. Anyway, if you guys are looking to buy any FIFA 16 coins, make sure you go and check out buycheapfifacoins.com. Their link will be down in the description below and you can use J54 at checkout for 5% off your order. They're automated guys, so it's definitely worth checking them out. So, we're going to go ahead and open 6,000 FIFA points worth of FIFA packs, obviously. Okay, so um, this will be interesting to see what we can kind of get from here um, and kind of compare it to what we get in the, in the COD points as well. So, um, yeah, let's get, under, get this underway. We have actually been able to get some sick players in recent um, times. Well, for example, yesterday I managed to get Inform Connor Plyanka twice in one minute which was pretty insane i got legend owen the day before so if anything if, if my luck's anything to go by from the past couple of days i will be getting something half decent in these 6,000 fever points so we actually started this episode with 11,000 fever points um i don't know whether i'm going to keep this fully live or not um we're going to kind of have to wait and see because i don't think it, you know i'm going to be getting anything interesting enough to kind of keep this going come on oh striker striker Storage, okay, right, that's our first good player, I rate that, I do rate that to be fair. Um, Storage goes for, I don't even know how much it goes for, probably about 10k now, 10, 15k, but that's a decent pull. Ooh, Wilfred Boney, alright, so it seems as though the box Premier League strikers are coming out to play. Uh, we've had Daniel Sturridge and also Boney now. We've actually got 2,700 FIFA points now left, so... Um, this is going to be interesting to see what we can get from the final few packs because so far the only real good player, that, I know I did just talk about Boney, but the real, the only real good player that we've had is Daniel Sturridge and that's that end of. So um, yeah, I'm going to be hoping for a bit of an improvement in the final few packs, but let's wait and see. Centre mid Pjanic, we will take that 100% and that is up there with Sturridge to be honest. Um, that's a pretty decent pack, I'm liking that. Just give me an inform. We have got Pierre. Ugh. What is it? I can't remember the second part of his name. That's so embarrassing. But we managed to get Aubameyang. Um, that's very decent indeed. That is very decent indeed. So, uh, yeah, like a 20k player there. We'll place him on the transfer list every day of the week. Oh, 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 Pepe. All right. We'll, we'll roll with that as well. Another 84 red player. 84 rare players have been the ho that's the highest rating so far. I'm hoping to surpass that during the uh, the final few packs. Oh. Right then, here we are. We've got the final four packs to go through. I'm not I'm not feeling confident anymore. I don't think we're going to surpass our uh, our uh, ooh okay. It seems like every single time I talk, we manage to get something decent. But um, yeah, I don't think we're going to surpass our 84 rated uh, goal. Because we've had quite a few 84 rare players, Sturridge, Pjanic, Pepe, so um, yeah, I think it would take an inform to beat this now. But uh, yeah, we have got two packs remaining, you never know, the impossible could happen. Um, right, let's see, come on, this next pack, okay, so that was absolute crap. Uh, Zila, and then the final pack, before we switch over onto COD, let's see, I'm putting my controller down now. Come on, Lacazette, bring me something decent, Striker. Hunter Law, I thought that was going to be something better than it actually was. And Remy, I suppose you could say Remy's a decent player. But um, yeah, take that into consideration, what we've got so far. And now we're going to go ahead and check out Call of Duty and see what we can get in some of these Black Ops 3 supply drops. All right then, here we are. We are on Call of Duty now. Um, as you can see, we've got 5,000 COD points. We're going to be opening all of these rare supply drops. Um, they're the only ones that you can actually purchase with COD points. So... Here we go. Let's get straight into this. Can we get anything decent straight off the bat? 
We've got an epic flipping Outrider body feed. That does look pretty sick to be honest. Um, I don't know, all right, Outrider, okay, yeah, that, I'm a little bit dumb there. Um, <laughs> but you know what, I'm, I'm feeling confident about that. That was pretty decent. Ooh, okay, I'm sorry, just mid video. I've just seen that Jose Mourinho has now left Chelsea. Wow, okay, that's a bit of an interrupt. Sorry, I'm sure you guys will be able to understand that. Wow, okay, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of that. That has got to be a talking point. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with that. Right, okay, let's go, let's go, come on, let's keep this going. I know I'm, I'm doing this because, like, so that, um, ooh, a legendary KGB KN44 high caliber variant. All right, all right, well, to be honest, with these legendary, um, like, variants, to be honest, I don't really see that much of the appeal. Um, like, I know, you know, they might look cool, or I, I don't know what the perks are personally to them. I'm a FIFA, I'm a FIFA guy, so yeah, you guys know that um, I'm not necessarily all clued up about all the latest updates, etc. In COD, but so far, all I all I know is that we are having a pretty sick pack opening. That is what I'm talking about. We have got Transgression BRM Camo, we've got the Ripper Spectre, Spectre Torn, and we've got the El Peto Emblem. That's pretty, come on man, that's pretty sick. Transgression is like the red liquid floating about the gun. Um, yeah, I really, really, really like that, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I'm just gonna equip that emblem, you know? Why not? Why not? Right, let's keep going. I'm already having a lot more fun, guys. I'm already having a lot more fun on flipping Call of Duty than I am on, uh, than I, well, than I was on, on FIFA. I don't know what it is, maybe it's a new game, so I'm like all for it and stuff, but, um, yeah, I mean, it's it's going well so far. Oh shit, that is that is quality. Ice camo for the M8 as well. Oh my god, right, I'm loving this. I'm genuinely loving this. This is quality. Two epics in one pack, um, mate. This is this is quality. I I actually love these flipping cop points. And this is probably the only lot that I probably will spend this year. I don't know. I don't know, I might put more on. That is a very, very, very nice camo for the MR6. That is very nice indeed. Wow. Okay. I'm liking that a lot. There we go. And we've got the, the Seraph Body Theme Knight. That looks pretty cool as well. Don't Like I said, don't really know too much about the variants, but you know what? There we go. Um, let me know in the comment section below if you think this is already better than the, than the FIFA packs. Let me know. Um, I know I've had a few packs which haven't been amazing on here. But, uh, well, supply drops, I should call them. I know I'll probably get a bit of hate now in the conversation below for that. But, yeah, you know, um, I'm, I'm actually enjoying this. I'm having more fun opening these packs on, on COD. It's, it's mad. Ooh, okay. War-torn M8 camo. I haven't seen that, but from the looks of it, it looks like fire might come up from, obviously not out the gun, but the liquid inside might look like a bit like fire. Uh, could seem like a, an absolute ridiculous um, thing to say, but yeah, I, I think that could be could be correct. I'm pretty sure that Spectre Night Body theme was a duplicate as well, so I'll be looking to cash in on that after this. Uh, right, let's see. Let's see what the rest of we've got. Come on. Oh, Transgression XR2 camo. Um, yeah, that's pretty decent. I don't really use the XR2 that much. I don't really rate it as a gun, but um, to be honest, it's still nice to have a pretty sick class, pretty sick camo there if I do actually ever want, want to end up using it. Epic monochrome camo, camo, camo for uh, the Argus, which is actually a shotgun, which I seem to get killed by so many flipping times. It's an absolute nightmare. So it's kind of like my nemesis, to be honest. Um, right, here we go. Give up, legendary Spectre Taunt. Love that. Right, okay, we have got three supply drops left. Three rare supply drops left. Oh, we've got their mono... Oh, I don't really care about the Weevil, man. Okay, that's all right. We'll have that. Right, let's move on to the final pack then. Let's go. Let's see what we can get. Can we end on the legendary or an epic? Please. Yes, man. There we go. Templar Prophet Body Theme. I'm, I'm going to roll with that. I'm going to roll with that 100 days of the week. Um, 100 days of the week. Seven days a week. There we go. Anyway... There we go. I've got to say, I, I don't know if you can tell by what I'm, how like, how I'm expressing myself, but that was much better than FIFA. I don't know what's going on. I really, really enjoyed that. 
Um, so if you guys want to see more videos like this, by all means, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, maybe next time I should do like 12,000 FIFA points and then, uh, like I said, about 30 pounds worth of cup points. But um, yeah, let me know in the comment section below if you like this. Do you want to see me use some of this stuff uh, that I've got in these supply drops in a video? Maybe, maybe I could do like a seven minute demolition or seven minute free for all. I don't know, something like that. Um, it would be really interesting to see if I could add Call of Duty into some more FIFA gameplay and stuff. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new around here. Drop a like on the video if you did enjoy it. That'd be absolutely amazing. And, um, yeah, I'll catch you next time. Peace.